Ice conditions are looking good on Lake Winnebago. Yeah, one thing the cold does, right? And uh, Emily Deem is in Oshkosh with more. Good morning, Em. Good morning. We are at the Merritt Street Landing, and let me tell you, ice conditions on Lake Winnebago are awesome right now, but the weather changes every day. So the Otter Street Fishing Club makes sure that the conditions are good for fishermen that are heading out. Look at Todd right now, heading onto the ice with a plow. Don Herman is here with me this morning with the Otter Street Fishing Club. Don, tell me what Todd's going to be doing this morning right now. Well, this morning, because it is cold weather, the crack opened up, so we're going to have to move the bridge. Then we'll finish plowing because, uh, you know, we had this cold weather and we had a lot of wind. And out here, when it's windy, it doesn't matter if it snowed or, or whatever, the wind just blows this snow around. It's 35 miles long, so the roads plug right up. Yeah, and right behind us is your truck, similar to what Todd has. So why don't you just go over some of the stuff that you have on there to help you plow and get everything clear? Well, we have the truck. These, these plows are built with all volunteers. Actually, this one was built in 1978. We still use it, but we put it on a new truck. Uh, we've had a lot of different trucks over the years. You know, Otter Street, with the donations that we get from uh, the fishermen and the roads and everything and all our events, that's what we, we buy these trucks so people can go out fishing. Yeah. Look at Todd way out there. Why don't we just talk about the ice conditions right now? They're looking pretty good, right? The ice conditions are, remember last year at this time, yeah. this was open. And uh, we didn't put our bridges out till February 7th. This year we put our bridges out January 3rd. So we're a month ahead. And uh, it's, it's good conditions. Uh, I mean, there still are danger spots, always. But, you know, have fun with it this year. We don't get a lot of years like this. This is the first time, this is the second earliest we ever put our bridges out in 40 years. Wow. And this lake, I mean, when it's the weekend, it is packed here. And you need to make sure it's clear for all the people, right? They park in their trucks. We're, Otter Street and all the fishing clubs around, we're all volunteers. So you got to remember, you know, some people will call us up, hey, the roads aren't plowed. Well, we all work. So when we have time, we try to plow every time it snows. But you got to remember, when it snows out here and it's windy, it's like a whiteout. You can't see nothing. It's not like plowing on in the city or anything. It's, it's a whiteout, whiteout. You can't see. And if people want to keep up with conditions, where can they go for that, Don? You can just call Otter Street. We have a hotline. It's 231-6101. And you can go on my Facebook page for Sunk Dive and Ice Service. We keep ice conditions every couple days. That's what we do. Now, you're going to see us because you're coming with me, right? You're coming with me out on the truck. Yeah, so I hope see, we can go out there. You'll see this plow. You'll see how it works. The snow just flies. I mean, we, we have roads out here just like in the city. Only we don't have the white markers. Unbelievable. <laughs> Don, thank you so much for being with us. We'll send it back to you.